Good to have the old girl back, Andrew. My name is Tony Bennett, and I'm from Bethel, Maine. My team is myself, of course, Codfish. Codfish? Cod yeah. Fish. How are you doing? Good. Codfish. Codfish. <laughs> Isn't that <laughs> what they call you? <laughs> and my best friend, Duke. Load up, Duke. Want me, Dad? Load up. Duke, what do you think? Uh -huh, you gonna go to town? <laughs> Duke opens a lot of doors for me. Stay right here. Where'd you go, Duke? You want a treat, boy? I think she's got a treat for you here somewhere. <laughs> what do you got, boy? What do you say? Me and Tony have been dickering together for about 20 years. You good, Codwell? What do you think, Codwell? I was thinking more like three. We work off each other, you know? We give each other hints. Let's do it. Let's right. do it. Sounds, Let's like, do a it. Sounds, Sounds like a deal to me. Me and Codwell, we deal everywhere. One minute, we're in a dusty old dingy barn. <laughs> <laughs> Next minute, we're in downtown Portland. Nice place you got here. Oh, thank you. Dickering's buying, selling, swapping, trading, wheeling and dealing for something somebody else has got that you're trying to get. All right, you got a deal. You got a deal? You got a deal. <laughs> <laughs> and you're trying to get it for the least of money you can and hopefully sell it for all you can. Do you know what this is? I got an idea. It's money. You might just want it for yourself or you might need to buy it. I'm going to run up there and look at that canoe real quick. You might not have something that your neighbor needs, the money that he needs for it, but you might have something else that he needs, a rototiller, a lawnmower, a wood splitter, or your help. $7.75 right now, lunch and a couple cold beers. You got it. I guess the show, if I had to say how it's changed anything, I guess it'd be it's opened more doors for us and there's a few more avenues than there was. Pull it off in the next 48 hours. <laughs> really? <Yeah. laughs> Drop what I'm doing and run after <laughs> what you're doing. <laughs> Obviously, I'm extremely handsome. People recognize us now. When we go somewhere, we get picked out of the crowd. Hey, I've seen that show all the time, man. <laughs> the first thing they ask is, where's Duke? And they start looking around. And nine times out of 10, he's peeing on their rose bush, or he's still in the cab of the truck. He's the one that makes it all happen. He makes the magic happen. 